Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last year in October, Microsoft started working on a new color picker in the Edge browser for desktop. And I'll leave that video down below. I posted on the new color picker. But just a quick recap. Uh, in the preview versions of Microsoft Edge, if you enable a command line flag, currently, if we head to the appearance page, here we can see a new color picker which um, lets you create themes with custom colors. And if you want to know how to enable this feature uh, in Edge Canary or Edge Dev as an example, then go check that previous video out. Now, how this all works is obviously you click on pick a color and yeah, we've got the slider to uh, obviously drag to your desired color and then you can use the little picker to get to your desired shade. But currently, um, how this all works, which I'm showing you now in Edge Canary 122, which is uh, the latest preview version, is the only way you can apply that color to your browser is to click somewhere else on an empty space in the browser. So there we go. And you can see my toolbar, title bar, sidebar, and so on. The color of that has been changed to the blue theme. Now, this is a little bit confusing um, because obviously, there's no apply or cancel. Now, this may be set to change because um, Microsoft now has furthered their progress on this feature. It's still very much in its infancy. And if we just head over to a screenshot once again provided by Leo over on X, here we can see now that they are starting to roll out an apply uh, tab, which I think will be a nice move, a cancel button and tab. And here we can also see there's a section. I don't know if you can see that properly uh, in the video, but yeah, at the top, there's a recent section. So this seems at this stage, um, it will be a section that will show you your recently used colors. And then obviously, yeah, we can see the slider has been moved from the bottom to the top. So I think if this is a feature you would use in the future, that um, having these buttons would clear up a little bit of confusion, apply and cancel, and also just that little improvement for your recently used colors. And this at this stage is not available as yet in the stable version. And there's still a bit of work to do on this. But um, I personally do feel a feature like this uh, could make its way down into the stable version. And if and when that does happen, obviously I will keep you guys posted and in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.